Shinna Dark Games. Well, hello and welcome back, my lovelies, for another episode of Help Wanted. I believe this is part five. Yesterday, we had a couple of mishaps. Um, I did Pir Foxy's Pirate Ride to try to find Helpy. Um, some people said you have to hit Buccaneer first, and some people say you just have to keep you have to keep doing it. And Helpy was spawned. I did that initially for like twenty minutes trying to get Helpy to spawn. He never spawned, so I did. Um, hallways and beat it on my second time i just had to turn the volume down so fun time I mean, fun time freddy so dread bear uh wouldn't scare me because his laughing is what gets my anxiety going um and um then i beat fun time freddy i'll show you the trick for that um uh y'all should have been getting this video today instead of it just being recorded today um, but I had some mishaps, um, my video, first of all, I didn't have my mic plugged in correctly last night, um, and I didn't realize it, and so after the fact, I think it was because I had bought a yoga mat so I could, you know, feel, like, where I was at since I had turned my boundary off, and it was, still had a lot of paint smell from the company, and I ended up getting sick from the fumes. It gave me a little bit of, it caused a little bit of motion sickness with the pirate ride because I did it so much. It just enhanced it so I was feeling sick half the episode. And then when I went to do um, Hallway and Fun Time Freddy, I didn't realize it, but my recording stopped. So I had on and off audio the whole video because of my mic. Then I had no recording of my Fun Time Friday in Hallways, which made me mad because those were the two scariest things I did last night in the episode. And I was like, I'm just going to trash the whole episode tomorrow when I get to work. I'm going to do it again. And I got the swatch, and I wanted to track my heart rate last night, but I couldn't because um, uh, my watch was haptic. Because usually when you get these watches, they'll come at least somewhat charged, you know, at least halfway. So last night when I got it and opened it, it was at 9%. And I was like, well, I can't do it. I can't get my heart rate with that to see what my heart rate is when I play these. So, but I'm going to show you this before I get started. Um, and no, I'm not endorsing this or not. I got these from Amazon. I thought they were cute. I got a How to Draw Five Nights at Freddy's. And I got the official cookbook. If y'all interested in these, just go to Amazon. They're really cute and they're cheap. But without further ado, let me get on into the episode and I will come back when everything is up. Okay? Okay, you guys, I am back. I'm going to keep an eye on my dot on my screen to make sure I stay in the game tonight. And it's recording. Um, I'm going to... Um, I'm going to look one more time to make sure... My game is recording, just to make sure. Oh, hey, Glitchtrap. You're getting a little bit closer. But, as you can tell, we did find some pretty. And we unlocked Nightmare on. Um, so, tonight's episode, we're probably going to um, do hallways again. And like I said, I'm going to turn my volume down. I think that helps me. And then, um, do we do hallway? We're going to do Fun Time Freddy. And then if we have time, I may try Plush Baby again. Um, let me get my volume turned down. This is the only way I seem to be able to do this without pumping my anxiety through the freaking roof. Um, I'm so scared. Oh, God, okay. Again. Quiet. 
Okay. Whoa, that was close. This is intense, even though I don't hear Freddy. Because I have off my volume. I'm still nervous. So I want to look behind me, but I know I better not. There's Foxy. I want to look, I'm tempted to look behind me so bad that I don't need to. Oh! Hopefully by the time I get to this door, it'll be shut. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Shit! Oh. <laughs> Damn. I feel like I was so close. Like I was so close. Oh my gosh, I'm so close to that. See, I need to watch out when I recenter myself because I think that's what messed me up from my recording. I think I did something and I got myself out of it. So, um, I'm hallucinating Freddy laughing. Oh! I was too close to the door. Whether or Nightmare Bonnie, whatever. I think, I think it was Nightmare Bonnie. <laughs> well, that's not I got it on second attempt, but I guess this will be okay. Um, I just hope I get Fun Time Freddy the first time because he's kind of sound based, so you have to. Um, I wish you move faster. Um, so you kind of have to turn it up a little bit so you can hear his audio cues. You don't really need his audio cues per se. Please don't open while well. <gasps> Gosh. Okay. I was too busy looking at the door and I was like... I was hoping that one door wouldn't open and then... I just want to just walk down this hall. Okay. Let's go this way. This was a sprint button. Scary. Please don't open the doors, please don't open. Maybe there's a lot of set of doors. Okay. Just walk. Just walk. Just walk. Just walk. Just walk. Come on. Come on, door. Come on. The NAF for a bedroom. <gasps> he was right there. Or is he Oh my gosh, you saw that. Hall. Oh, I meant right in the prize box, too. Maybe I moved a little bit. I don't know. Oh, God, he was right there. Like, literally. I mean, I don't know if he's supposed to be that close, but I feel like he wasn't that close before. I don't even feel like eating that. I was, my nerve, he was right there, reaching for me. Keep in mind that this DLC pack is okay. More than a so now... Which has absolutely since no we did um hallway so have fun. um um 
and go back. Fun Time Freddy. Um, I will kind of tell you the premise of it before I go in so I don't have to explain too much what I'm doing it, even though it probably make me feel better. The premise of Fun Time Freddy is when you go in, you're going to see the door on the right, the door on the left, the clock on this dresser, go to the left side, shut the door, do an L shape with the door and the dressers to shine bonnet and bonbon or whatever. Um, keep doing that till about 4 o'clock when Bonnet pops out of the closet. Go to the closet door, pull it closed until you hear, hear Freddy's laugh. Hold it shut until you hear Freddy's laugh. Then go back to where you were and then resume until 6 o'clock. Pretty much. Um, I gotta turn my volume up a little bit so I can hear this a little. I'm so scared of this. I did this last night. I don't know how I did it. We'll see if I can do it without getting killed tonight. Uh, we'll see. Okay, ready? Okay, ready? Door shut, right? Okay. Why does everything look bigger tonight? Last night everything looked smaller. I don't know why everything looks big all of a sudden. <laughs> He spawned before one o'clock. He's not supposed to. Okay. Why is he playing some Freddy at this door? I'm gonna nut up. I feel smaller this go around. I don't know if this works all the time, I don't know. Want it to stay away from me. I can't wait for this night to be over. I'd rather do plush baby, at least I know what to expect. Two <gasps> on it. Keep going like this. I'm scared it's gonna pop up at the door. Okay, three o'clock. Three o'clock. Make sure that door is still shut. Bomba, bomb the bonnet. This fucking scary. And I feel like I said I feel smaller than I did yesterday. Maybe it's my orientation. I feel child size. Yesterday I felt. A little more. Okay, it's four o'clock. She should be going coming through the closet. Okay, ready? What happened? I'm dead. I know you're over there somewhere. I want to fit a work from this side. I'm still moving my hands like it's not six o'clock yet. Oh my gosh. Let's see what my heart rate is on that. 119 beats per minute. I don't know if that's. Yeah, that's. Okay. Um, a butter something. Butter for one. Okay. Now, I don't know where we're at for time, would you but like I would to do Plush Baby. Fun fact? One of the previous development teams made a hilarious a time mistake, or two. one that may or may not have resulted in an undesirable anomaly entering the game's code. Please accept that statement as our full legal disclaimer and absolution of responsibility and potential harm to you. 
try it one time. I doubt I'm going to do this on second. This is probably going to take me a lot of tries. But. Let me put down that controller because I don't need that hand. So. Okay. Oh shit, she's... <laughs> I didn't know what time it was. I'll try it one more time. Ah, what was that? It was like a blurred boundary thing. I had my boundary turned off and it was like... Oh no. Okay. I'll do it one more time. One more time, one more time. When my hand's stuck. Oh, okay. I'm gonna have to do some practice with that. But you guys, guess what we can do a little bit? Uh, listen to all the tapes. Um, I'm gonna try Nightmare Mary on, but I don't even know a good strategy for him, to be honest with you. I don't. So, um,. Here, have a meaty bite. That went over your head. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, so, I'm not doing my mouths of those yet. I did those. Uh, yeah. I don't want to do any of those that night. Um, so, I just got to prize counter a little bit, see what we got to play with over here. So, I'm always scared someone's going to get me from over there. See, give me the office. My office thing. That's so tiny. Like, what am I going to do with it? What am I going to do with that? Whew, pull myself off. Lush baby. But hold on. Doesn't say plush baby. How many coins do I have? I got that, that. Okay, guess we don't have much. Um, so we're back here. He's standing in a different pose. Good day, sir. Good day. Good step. Even though you're gonna try to stuff me in a suit. Eat your candy, okay, sir? But you guys, um, I'm gonna call it an episode right there and I'm going to uh, stop recording stop recording okay I stopped recording um I was trying to go ahead and quit so I could take my headset off um, my, um, I can't okay I, was, I couldn't do anything for a minute I'm just trying to go ahead and get out of it now 
so um, I don't have anything else to do. Uh, and I wanted to make sure all my video was there and the record light was still on before I, you know, until I was ready for it to stop. But let me look at my time. I'm starving too, so I haven't eaten since I've been at work this afternoon. Um, oh gosh, my head says I want to stay on the thing right now. Okay, we're doing good. We're doing good. Um, it's almost 18 minutes, so we did good. Well, that was um, uh, Five Nights at Freddy Help Wanted, Part 5. Um, if you're watching this, everything went well with my recording this time. Um, so that was an easy way to beat Fun Time Freddy. If you've ever had any reservations on beating him um, and were too scared to, this is a way that you can beat him foolproof. Because I'm the biggest scaredy cat. I was not wanting to play Fun Time Freddy. Because I didn't know how to beat him. I didn't know the strategy. I didn't want to have to do a hundred different things. I didn't know how I was going to beat him. And then I came across that trick. And I'm not going to give anybody credit for this. And say thank you for your video. Because I watched several videos of people doing this. And everybody thinks they came up with the idea themselves. I don't know how many people actually did. Because you know more than one person can come up with the idea for something. I get it. Um... But who knows who really came up with it. They'll be like, oh, I just came up with it. I know one person contradicted themselves. I'm not going to say who it is, but one YouTuber. It's not a known YouTuber, but um, they they contradicted themselves because they said they, 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 they said they, they said they, I, they, they were like, I've tried this a couple times and it hadn't worked yet. Um, but hopefully it'll work this time. And then after they were done, uh, they were like, yeah, that's the first time I've beaten that. You know, I've never beaten it like that before. And I'm like, huh? Really? But while ago, you just said. You just said. So, um. Kind of made me wonder. <laughs> I'm trying to find, but, yeah. My heart rate's back to 105. My highest heart rate was, max say, was 146. And my lowest was 65. But, um. Yeah, okay. I was just playing around with that so I can see what you guys hope you enjoyed that video. But like I said, that's a foolproof way of beating um, Fun Time Freddy. I did that twice. So that's my second time in a row beating him like that. And I was more scared the second time than the first time, to be honest with you. Because, first of all, my orientation was, I was smaller. Like, like, like the first time I felt like I was an adult in a kid's bedroom. And then... Tonight, I felt like a toddler in that little room. So, everything felt bigger, um, which was scarier. And then, when I went to the closet, you notice when I shut it, and then I, somehow I ended up at the other side. And my hand that was closing the door was, like, over here. It's like I was holding this door still, but I was holding the door on the other side. So, so I was worried if Freddie was going to be able to get to me. And I was like, oh, my God. And then when I was playing, in the beginning when I was playing, Hallway and Dreadbear was behind me. I don't know if it's supposed to be like that or not, but when I turned around, he was right there and he was like, and I was like, oh my God, was he really that close to me? Or is that how, was that how, really how close he was walking behind me? Or is he supposed to be that close if I look back then just to scare me and give me the illusion he's coming after me? I mean, I know some people, they look and they see his silhouette on the wall. So maybe he was supposed to be that close to me at that point. I don't know. But we, we did it. We beat it again tonight. So, you guys, I really appreciate you guys hanging with me until the end of this video. If you see what the, my temperature is on my heat. Okay. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. And actually hit the like button. Don't just say you like it. Hit the like button. Um, don't forget the notification button so you're notified every time a new video comes out. Also, don't forget... To give a big power tap to the sub button if you already have not done so and become part of the Jenna Crew slash squad slash fan today. Also, you guys, um, reminder um, to leave me a positive comment in the comment section below. And I do have merchandise on Teespring, but I haven't used that site in a while because, you know, my channel hasn't been really doing that great. Um, so I hope y'all continue to support me, tell other people about my channel, and get my channel where it deserves to be. And I'm not saying that to try to say I have a spectacular channel, but 
I do strive to be a great content creator. I love creating content for you guys. I'm passionate about what I do. And I love putting on content. So I think, you know, everybody that does that deserves a little, a little recognition. Um, just saying. But you guys, all my little beard is looking at me. But just show me a little bit of love. But you guys, I hope you like the episode. And I um, hope I get to play Star Playing Help Wanted 2 soon. Um, and I, I'm sorry, I'm just now getting to play Help Wanted 1 for you guys. Um, it's just that I haven't. Um, I know I played Help Wanted a little bit in flat mode on my channel. And then when I got it in VR, I was like, well, I'm going to give it another go and try to play a little bit more of it since it's in VR. So I'm doing that because I want to and I want to share it with you guys. So you guys, um, with that being said, and I'm sorry I'm just holding my mic like an idiot. But um, I'm glad the light's still green. Um, so like I was saying, uh, yeah, just um, continue to support my channel and tell other people about my channel. Oh, let's